What's up guys, Son of Beast here. We are back for another game as we are about to be showing you for our next game, for our next segment. This is the Son of Beast on NBA 2K20. Next. And you know, I'd like to give a special suggestion and say, hope you guys are having a great Thanksgiving so far. And um, yeah, I had a lot of fun time too. Also, being uh, being infected by um, by some people who wants to know about turkey, mashed potatoes, stuffing, cranberry sauce. You know, there's a lot of stuff as you can imagine. Uh, all the kind of the Thanksgiving foods. It just you're just even that good for your health. And also, it's just enough to uh, make a suggestion to uh, to have a good uh, a good idea of a combo of Thanksgiving Day meal. Anyways, now we get ready to start uh, for our next NBA game. But we're back next week. But we're back right now and doing our next game as we're about to be seeing the next game that we are looking at. This is the Memphis Grizzlies. As, as Jackson Jr. plays against Demian Lillard, Portland Trail Blazers. And guys, let me know about this one. It's their Portland Trail Blazers 50th anniversary. So, you notice they played really well. So, I'm, what I want to do is, I want to play with the Portland Trail Blazers. But, let's see what the uniform's going to be, look like. Yeah, there's got kind of, there's kind of the same stuff already, but um, you know, just enough to make the uh, list. There's a, there's a lot of them. John Morant was drafted right now, and he knows the best player that he could get. And let's see what's the other one. Okay, there we go. And I gotta make sure it's the right one. I'll take any every socks I would like to take care of. Yeah, this one would be a better idea. Anyway, though, let's get started off. And uh, and the lineups are gonna be on the on TV. But anyway, but I'm just not gonna uh, do anything uh, as I would say. On this week's episode of 2K TV, it's our Thanksgiving special, which means we hear from. I don't know anything about I'm saying three. Yeah, I was wrong. Let's continue right now and start the pregame show. The Trailblazers focused as they walk into the locker room earlier on. Their job is basic tonight. Get a win on their home court. And the game arrival, sponsored by Express. Dress like a pro. Soaring high above the Willamette River towards our location tonight in downtown Portland. It's coming up next. As we notice, things are just going to look the right way that we are looking at. The 50th anniversary is right in the middle of the court. And here's his favorite, David Aldridge. Blazers coach Terry Stotts had previous head coaching stints in Atlanta and Milwaukee. But it was as an assistant coach in Dallas, where he helped win the 2011 title, that he rejuvenated his career. Stotts wasn't sure he'd get another coaching opportunity. But after that, he sent the stars a line. Kevin, he's now in year eight as head coach in Portland. And now here's the lineups for right now for the starting matchups. And here's what John Morant's record is. 19.1, 1.4. Last five games were 19.6 and 2.4. That's because you notice how the record is keeping up with the uh, the season they go. And now he's already drafted. Here's the starting lineup. We got Morant, Brooks, Crowder, Jackson Jr., Valencinas, Lillard, McCollum, Hood, Anthony, and Whiteside. Yep, as you notice right now, Whiteside's been traded to the Portland Trail Blazers. So we're not sure if we're going to see him again. Taylor Jenkins is the head coach. Just the first season with Memphis. Only 20 to 60. <clears throat> and right now, let's see who's going to tip the, tip the ball first. And it looks like the Blazers win the tip-off. 
Anthony looking at Here we got Anthony. We got Lillard. Lillard tries the three. Knocks it out. Ooh, and Memphis ball comes in. Since it's coming out too low, I just need to turn that up a little. Yeah, I think 14 is better. There you go. So you, so you can still check it out that recently by going on to uh, the NBA 2K. And you can uh, check out the news reporting. And, and you can start chatting with the communication. So head on to the NBA 2K20 and see how you can uh, perform and be, play like a pro. Make sure you ask your parents for permission. I'm sorry, permission. And it turns it over. Whiteside takes the ball away. Here's Carmelo Anthony, and a layup puts it up as Lillard put in the assist. Here's Morant. Morant on the middle. Morant goes to Crowder. So on to Valentinus. Shoots for the two, and it's good. That spin just dusted the defense. So that's John Valentinus. And remember, it's Val. If you can't say it all over last names, you could say Val. Or Valentinus. I don't care which one you could pick. Ooh, Crowder took the steal with the bounce pass. Crowder with two. That's no good. That was McCall with the with the rebound. McCollum with the ball. He goes to Anthony. McCollum for two. We rebound the ball. Here's Anthony, and it turns over to Jackson Jr. He drops those in between Here's Crowder. Crowder, no good with the layup. That's two in a row. I'm sorry, what? Oh, wait, what? I think that's only one miss for the uh, for Crowder. But you don't know. White side. Shoots the two. Oh, he got a three. I thought that was going to be a challenge. I thought he stepped on the line because uh, that was going to be a two. So I was on white side for the three. And now here's Morant. Screen pick. Jackson Jr. In the paint. Brooks over to Crowder. He dishes back to Morant. Oh, he got the three in. And that was Crowder with the, I mean, Brooks or something like that. We all know. Crowder, but that was the assist. Three thirty left. Hood on the wing. Scoots up in the corner. Here's it. This is the white side. Six to shoot. The Trailblazers need to get off a shot. A shot. Oh, it went in. That that beat the shot clock out of here. That was McCollum. A great shot. Morant passes to Jackson Jr. Here's Valcinus. And it doesn't make it in. That's two misses for Valentini. One miss for Valentini. Dominion Lillard. And all right, the Lillard. Oh, amazing layup. That's two points for, for the Blazers for Lillard. Two birdie left. Just over three and a half minutes gone. Three half of the minutes right now. Crowder. Valentinius with the screen. The foul and it counts the basket. White side side on a first personal foul. <clears throat> and now we have a substitution coming in. All five are subbed out. All five are subbed in, except for Crowder. And all five coming out. All five came in. Here's two, two shots for Crowder. No shot for the one. I'm sorry, that, that's supposed to be one shot. Simmons 
Mystic three. That did not help it in. Go with the bucket, and that missed it again. Clark missed the three. So two of each guys didn't make the threes, and it didn't help it out. Paysmore with a good shot. It goes in. That was on the line, and it was a two. Under two minutes remaining. We got we got Anderson as Portland leads 12 to 7. 135 left here in the first Crowder. Layup goes in and that puts another two pointer. Well I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do anything right now. It, this is not how it's supposed to go. Too little. Swings it over to Simmons. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Baseball. Didn't catch the three in, so that looks like a fade away to me. And block! That was... Who was that again? Lavishar! Simmons, right over to Little. With 50 seconds to go. Baysmore makes the two. So that's another two-pointer to come in. 43 seconds left. Only 43 seconds left. 40 seconds now remaining. Anderson on the, on the paint. Anderson made a two point. And that's going to put it up 14 to 11. He goes right up to Little. Only 19 seconds left. And they got a block by Memphis Grizzlies. Anderson up top. Memphis. Anderson puts in number two. Well, this is not calling for this one. I'm calling for a timeout now. Thanks to Kyle Anderson's size advantage over most of his matchups. So that didn't count that one in. What is happening with the with the defense? We got to try this one out, and we got to do it again. All right, so I made the uh, switch for the uh, for the offensive start. As good as Clark and Crowder, Clark stays on the court, and there's a reach and foul called on Anderson. All five are subbed out. Lillard, McCollum, Hood, Anthony, and Whiteside came back in. All there got hydrated up and all ready to go. Dwayne Lillard. Oh, almost went a buzz beater. What amazing first quarter that comes up from Hazan Whiteside and Dominion Lillard. We'll be right back after this one. Be a star in your role. You know, I think it's one thing to say, let's be consistent. Let's play hard. Let's do all of these things. And I think as competitors, as professional athletes, we're going to play hard. You're going to be competitive because we're competitors. We don't make it to this level for no reason. Um, but I think at this level, you also have ego. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The main Lillard, he wants something better to get out here. Uh, he wants to keep this team play a great play and, and make the key to make the absolute necessary to make the game look better. We are starting with the second quarter and let's find out who can get the best one in. Here we have his hood. He's right up to a white side. He's got to get out of the paint. No good for Lillard, and he missed again. So that was a great first start for the uh, first quarter. That a almost a buzz beater putting up by Dominion Lillard. Putting up with a great, great spot. McCollum for two. Here's Lillard. Here's Lillard. Lillard up. And one. Jones with the foul. That's number 21. First personal foul is putting on a line for, for shooting on Memphis. Now shooting one is number zero, Demian Lillard. Demian Lillard. Demian Lillard. Demian Lillard. Uh, I forgot if I say it correctly, but if you but if you have it, post the comments down below and I'll uh, and I'll uh, and you can let me know if it's Demian or Demian. The main. I say the main. Sorry about that. 
That shot went good for Lillard. Now here's uh here's Melton. He's covered up with McComb. Kuderick. And Whiteside with the rebound. A great a great defensive rebound putting up in. Rodney Hood. Lillard on out of Hood. Pass up to McComb. Great shot, and that puts up another two points for McCall. He now have five. Let's see it is. Yep, five and only one rebound here left. Melton against McCall. Here's Clark. Off the pointer. And that's not that's not gonna put him in another spot since no good for for the Memphis Grizzlies. Puts up by Lillard. Two point and no good for our Lillard. But I can't deny my laser focus on the sport. Kevin, he's Melting. in his father's footsteps. Off the point. Another miss for the Memphis. Here's Carmelo Anthony. Screen on hood. To the inside. Good shot fake as McComb will take one. McComb and a foul is on Anderson. That's his first foul from Memphis Grizzlies. CJ McComb, he knows how he can play it uh, better than handling the ball. But when he gets the layup, it's kind of like getting like an air ball. But someone just could have, someone just blocked the ball. And probably it could stop again by, uh, by hurting the other, uh, of a guess. Anderson only had one foul. Just need to fix that. And let's see if it shoots comes in. It does for the first throw. See what you think about McCollum as a point guard. Is a McCollum is a point guard. Okay. Jackson Jr., Brooks Melton is stayed on the court, and Morant is back on the court. I don't know who. You got to figure that out. Two shots made in for McCall. And now here we have Morant against McCall. Morant! Uh, and there it goes. Carmelo Anthony has his first foul. That's double zero on the or on the Blazers. John Morant. Yep. There he goes. That ball counts in for the bucket. And now he has one shot remaining. Definitely not just a, not just a quite a better better reasoning by the answer. Morant with one. Memphis Grizzlies trying to put it back in the point. I don't think the Blazers can't help it. That's good for Morant. Yeah, that's good for Morant already. Morant really impacts the game in every area. It's incredible, Kevin. He gives you the points, the assists, the rebounds. Passes up to Bazemore. Screen not coming. And he stepped on the line. That turned it over. Only a first turn. Blazers have only had one turnover. Actually, two two turnovers. I meant to say. And now back on the other side, you got Moran against Lillard. Screens coming up on the left. Valachunas. Bucket six. Bucket six. And there's a pointer that comes in. So they're coming down with four points remaining. And they got three minutes to go in the first half. And now we have Baysmore. McCall. That's good. That puts it up another three for the Blazers. Trailblazers. Forgot to say that one. Yeah, it's only uh, like in one word. Melton against McCall. He needs to get the shot. Pocket six. 
And a foul goes on to the Beyond Lives Affair. It's going to go on Stella this year. Oh, man, I love Lava Sierra. He makes it look so easy. He makes it look so easy. is trying to get that layup in. And there's a foul called on called on Portland. Trailblazers. Valuchines will shoot two shots. And the clock stops at 2 minutes and 21 seconds. So whatever you do, Blazers fans, make, let me hear the noise. No good on the uh, and there's the first shot that missed it off the target. Brooks, Melton will be sitting out. Crowder is back on the court. And on the other side, we got all four. We got four of each. Lavasier. Lavasier. We'll be staying on the court. It's kind of like a Spanish name for naming uh, for the last name. Only one shot made in. That's one out of two. Here's Simmons. Simons? I think it is. Baysmore passes up to Levesy Sierra. Up a lip. That's good for the two. And we reach two minutes to go. We have 29 for Blood Trail Blazers and 21 for Memphis Grizzlies. Nice layup for Jay Moran. Just put it up by another point to put in the bucket. Simons puts it up to Harajonia. This is up to Fazemore. Screen coming. The layup puts it in for Baysmore. That's another pointer. That's six points in a row. Fade away, no good. As uh, Lavoisier has rebound, got to rebound the ball. Simons, yep, you're correct, Kevin. It was Simons, not Simmons with a double M, but only one M. Lavasi, Arizona to Simmons. Three to go. Little will shoot. And it's off target. That puts it back up. That's going to put it back and turn it over by Memphis. Crowder comes in to score. And that was an assist by Brooks. 45 to go. Baysmore to Lavasier. Baysmore pulling over to Simons. Up from 17, and it makes it in. Simon has another point. We come down to 30 seconds. Here's Crowder. 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 Jackson Jr. for the three. No good. Rebound putting up by Valuchines. 18.1 seconds to go. Here's Little. And he likes to forget about that one. And he decided to forget about that point, and we're going to go to the halftime. So Portland Trailblazers has six-point lead, and there are a lot of points coming up after the halftime show. And now on the court side, let's see who we have. Carmelo, what was the area of emphasis for your team during the first half? I know you want to keep it going in the second half. Thanks for your time. Back to you, Kevin. So Kamara Anthony was on the side court, and we'll be right back after the message. So we'll be right back, and don't go anywhere. We're back at the Moda Center. And with the scores being released by the Trailblazers, they have 33, 
and the Memphis Grizzlies has 27. So, with McCollum, he has a lot of opponents to make the advantage with, uh, with making the signal changing by making a few adjustments then. So as you know about McCollum, he just does a lot of uh, a lot of the points there. A lot of most careers with point the uh, changing. And then, and then when Lillard has a point in, he decided to, uh, to give it off to McCollum or or to anybody or like Bazemore or or something else. Uh was Whiteside or Hood or Carmelo Anthony, you know, there's going to be definitely a lot of players who's going to make that shot. Hassan Whiteside makes a no good fadeaway, and that shot missed again. Crowder. Crowder, this is to Morant. A lot of that bad defense, and Whiteside makes the rejection. Now Whiteside will take one. Layup good! That's a rejection there by the layup. And he done it again with another takeover. Morant in the paint. This is off to Valachines. Brooks Crowder. Over again. And a rebound. Crowder makes it one perfectly, making the back and the layup. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is getting a little too loud then. Uh, I, gotta, I have to settle that one down. Bounce passes to Anthony. And another one to Whiteside. Swing to the right. McCall. And it's good. That's another point for McCollum. Definitely have another one to take the advantage on the points. Morant. Wow, the fadeaway puts it in. That's another points for Morant. I think he's probably on the rookie. If he's still not, if he's still playing really good, then we're going to have to figure it out that he'll be on the pro. McCollum. Up the layup and no good. That's the, no, that's the first miss for McCollum. Morant again. That's two in a row. And the Blazers needs to take their second time out. Time call here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. You're right, Kevin. If they have to talk it over, so it looks like Whiteside was not picking up so really. Uh, I don't think he was not joining up with the uh, Blazers anymore. I mean, the Heats anymore. Look, uh, there's there's definitely a lot of a chance to uh, make Whiteside happen. A lot of a uh, lot of a supporting and making it better, helping the teammates on. It's just a lot of a uh, lot of information to get that set for. So I'm probably subbing out here, and I'm gonna have to find out Tolliver to to try one out. Gonna have to switch it off to uh, flow, and definitely uh, I won't do it anyway. So I only have one switch by Sullivan, by Tolliver. Portland and Memphis got enough to make the advantage for Memphis won five and Blazers won seven. So they're way ahead than than the Memphis going on in the Western Conference uh, standings. But we're gonna have to see if the Portland Trail Blazers can come back in the playoffs to do it again. Another shot for McCall. That's another layup. 14 points. Lillard never got, got any other points uh, in the second half, but we're going to see what he can do. Melton with no... With two great D by McCollum. Rodney Hood. And a shot goes in. Clark has his first foul. I know who you're thinking. Carmelo Anthony to Rodney Hood. Yes. That counts the basket. That definitely did. Now Rodney Hood will be at the line. Shooting one. Clark only had his first personal foul. 
Don't make ever a sudden fouls. Shot goes in. And they, and they lead ahead with 42 to 33. Lillard against Melton. Garderick. Jackson Jr. Over Carmelo Anthony. And a shot won't take the attempt to put it back in. Here's Tolliver on the wing. This is off to McCollum. McCollum putting the crossover again. The hood up by Tolliver. Tolliver with the fadeaway, and it's good. So that's another point for the Blazers. Only 225 remaining. 44 for the Trail Blazers and Grizzlies for 33. And that shot for Jackson Jr. puts him in the front of another bucket. I like that pick play. I mean, you can see how easy it makes. There's definitely going to be enough uh, to make the list. Now, here's Lillard. Eight points for him. McCollum. McCollum. Tolliver. Keeping the man alive. Here's McCollum. Up and away, and that's two misses for McCollum. The Blazers did not have the McCollum to take that shot. But they got to look open. They got to stop by shooting the threes or leave them a lame man alone. Melton. Jackson Jr. Five to go. For the shooting. Got it. No good. Rebound. Jackson Jr. delivers a punch in. For the two. Timeout taken by Portland Trail Blazers. It needs to be a lot more aggressive on defense, but that's going to have to bring up with another offensive look to make the help. I have some substitutions for the players on the Blazers. And as you know, we'll be subbing out. And Simmons comes in to check out Demaney Lillard. Demaney Lillard, of course. Here's Baysmore. Shot fake. Anthony on the wing. I mean the corner. The Moving the ball around. Simons with a great mo movement. And that's another point for the Blazers. Under one minute to go in the third quarter. Jones against Simons. Oh, oh, they couldn't just take the ball back. Memphis has the ball back. That's a dunk on Jackson Jr. And they're trying to trail it back. Carmelo Anthony to Henny Jr. Screen on Anthony. And it's another rebound for, for the Memphis. And that was Clark. Clark makes a better uh, shot. A second bucket of the game. Simons. Baseball. Simons for three. And no rebounds for the Blazers. So Jones is coming up. Off target for, for the Memphis. Baseball. Shot good. There's two buzzers. One for Demand Lillard, almost with the buzz meter. And with that one, comes up with another point for the Blazers. Buzz meter in the third quarter. 48 to 41. We'll be right back after this. It's time to check it out what the State Farm assist of the game is. And watch how it slices comes in. As you notice that Carmelo Anthony has just made a one in. Even you, just in case you haven't seen the play yet, this is what the Rodney Hood gets the gets amazing layup in. So the points comes in, and Rodney Hood with amazing assist by by Carmelo Anthony. So that's going to be probably uh, two assists that time. Well, we're going to have to figure that out again. Little bounce passes to Whiteside. And it's Simons in at the point guard. That's the group on the floor for Portland. Whiteside layup, no good. Jones. 
Guarded by Simons, and here comes Bazemore. Oh, the dunk by Bazemore is put in. What an amazing dunk performance for Bazemore. That's another point for Blazers. He's got 10 so far. They are not afraid to take the ball away and call by a foul. What amazing play. Right side with the rebound. Great defender on uh, Valachunes. Little. No screen to protect. Simons. Bounce pass to Whiteside. And another two pointer for Whiteside. That was the assist by Little. With a bounce pass. Jones against Simmons. That's, that's a good question. Uh, Morant at the lock, at the wing. Baysmore rejects it away. I'm showing you with a great block, with a great shot. And I was a little pass by Little. That's another assist. Making the teammate more. Need some. Uh, need to make a couple uh, adjustments again. Crowder. Almost at the corner. Screen on. Blocked by Whiteside, and that turns it in. <clears throat> and they're not going for a fast break since they're at this slow it down. Little makes a good basket. That is the assist by Bazemore. He has four assists right now. Timeout Memphis. Stop the clock for 350, and we're taking a look with another players to make a comeback. Anything look for the substitution will not be uh, terminated for the Blazers to put back. Yeah, all four subbed out, all four come in. And there's a good looking assist pass by Jackson Jr. That was Morant with another assist. I think he now has three, but we'll have to stay tuned for sure and see which assist that comes back in. Oh, Lillard forgot to uh, forgot that he did not show the player. Brooks comes up in the paint. The number one for Jackson Jr. and it's a reverse layup, putting in the bucket. A number ten points for Jackson Jr. McCollum up it goes, and another bucket for McCollum. So there's a difference between McCollum and Bazemore. Unfortunately, the white side needs to know which man he has. Great block, but it didn't recover for the uh, Blazers to beat the rebound. So Altunas has the points to put it back in. And McCollum puts it on the corner. Little, back to Lillard. Here's a three for Lillard. And off targets putting up by a call. The coach needs to tell the, the main Lillard to look for an open pass. Brooke with the dunk. 220 left. Blazers has meets only has one timeout remaining and two for Memphis. So there's still much to uh to proclaim about that one. Since uh since this is nothing going on again. I don't think Lil wasn't putting up a, a better points. Just one suggestion, and now the player of the game is going out to Hazan Whiteside. So most careers just noticed that back from uh, back from 2019 season, he played with the Miami Heat, and for noticing for 2018 to 19. He noticed that Hazan Whiteside is doing a better, uh, better intense game. 2-10 remaining, and Lavishier looking for open. Lavishier passes to Whiteside. Lillard to Whiteside. Again, and he drops it in. That's a two-pointer to put it back in. Hazan Whiteside got another points. 
So, what a great job for Zon Whiteside that he made. And the better points to put it back in, there's definitely going to be a lot more to come. Morant on the wing by Tunez. And it doesn't go in with the layup. Portland is lead, leading by 11. Push up the domain. Lillard! Another miss for the three. One of the offensive rebounders has to put it back in. McCollum rebounds the ball. A lot of frustration putting on the court to make it happen. White side. Screen on. Lava Sierra missed again. 55 seconds under one minute. Good track with the good three. Lillard will back up again. Just 42 seconds to go. He goes up by Rodney Hood. And it just keeps it going again. Oh, no. And he couldn't save the ball by the other team's score. Morant has it again as Crowder rejects the ball. And now their personal foul is on Morant. Lava Sierra will sub out. Carmelo Anthony will sub in. With 30 seconds to go. And they're going to have to take a five-second violation ball. I don't think they wouldn't have to take that again. Since uh, since this is not going to happen right, I think they need to talk things over. So we'll stick with you with us after this. So uh, I'll make a few, few quick, uh, uh, quick seconds, and then I'll put it back on. Since no substitutions is being made, only one stand up for Labashiere. Now Crowder will be uh, taking the ball by a five second violating the ball again. He found an open pass to Jackson Jr. 56 to 60. And the foul is putting up by Moran, his second personal foul. And now the one on one will be Portland Trail Blazers, two shots. The main Lillard will be shooting for two. And that puts it up by nine points, three assists of the games. Let's hope this will be 10. And he does. 10 points for our Lillard. Grizzlies with a final timeout remaining. Stopping 26 seconds. Sorry, I don't have any uh, substitution to bring out right now. I need to uh, make uh, game plans to try this thing out. Yep, that's all I'm going to have to do. There's no time to waste right now, so uh, the game will be almost done. Now Crowder will looking for Morant, and there he is. Inside, here's Jackson. Jackson Jr. with the layup. Trailing by four. And Carmelo Anthony coming up. The foul will be on Crowder. His first foul. Says he was not going to take a shot, but uh, he's going to go right into the corner and stop where he is. Two shots for Carmelo Anthony. Double zero. He has only two points and two assists right now. Let's see if this comes up by three. Good on the first. Good on the first throw. And the Blazers are catching away with Memphis's point. So both free throws are playing up by Carmelo Anthony with four points. There's 18 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Crowder misses up to Morant. Valachines 
Flipping the ball around. Grodzik misses. It's going to let go. And it will not stay back in. Last possession. No buzz beater for the Memphis. Portland Trail Blazers takes the win with 64 to 58. They would have been a closer one, but as we were like to be advancing with overtime. But it will not be sticking around with us for for the buzz beaters again. Only goes on white side is the player of the game. And only two of each has, has done a buzz beater. Thank you, Kevin. Damien, it looks like this team's progress can be measured by your improvement at the defensive end. And do we see that tonight? Um, we, we made some mistakes, like every other basketball team does. But I think we did a great job of making adjustments. You know, we got a little more physical. Um, you know, we did a great job of that. And that led to a big win, Damien. Thanks for your time, man. Kevin? Well, that's going to be doing us for tonight, and thank you for joining us with our next game. As it was on Whiteside's team, has is a player, the Jordan player of the game, and a lot of points are being pointed out by attacking. So there will be more NBA 2K20 games to come. And now here's a look at the uh, box scores on each team. Sorry, enough. CJ McCollum has only had 16 points. Only one rebound, and there's only uh, fouls putting on nothing. So that's going to be doing it for a, a better time with uh, appreciation. Next up is Lillard, only 10 points of the game. And there's definitely a lot of points to, uh, to make the comeback again, but there's nothing else to, tell, just to show it again. Baseball with the uh, with a steal, a dunk, a drive, a layup. And a two-pointer putting back in. So that's still not quite a lot of pressure to put up with four assists. I'm telling you, there's definitely a lot more. And here is the uh, top three of the star games. So it's Jay Morant with 16. CJ McCollum with 16. And finally is Dem Demian Lillard with 10 points. So that's going to do us for now, folks. Uh, thank you for joining us. And if you'd like to see some more videos, don't forget, you can subscribe to my channel, follow me on my social media, and more games are coming up soon. As we join us for next week, we're seeing some more NBA action. The Cleveland Cavaliers is facing on against the other team, noticing the Knicks. Who wants to know about Seymour and Seymour and Super Tan and Chalmers? Julie, it's uh, it's Kevin Knox facing against Kevin Love from the Cleveland Cavs. So thank you for joining us again. And if you want to see some more videos, don't forget you can subscribe to my channel, thumbs up to like the video, and don't and follow and follow me on my social media. I already said that twice. Once again. So with that. I'll see you all in next week on the NBA 2K20. And don't forget, more to come. Stick with us with another NBA action. Thank you for joining us. And with that, peace out, bitches. Till now for NBA 2K20 Dial.